I used to work downtown in San Francisco and it would get so screwed up I'd come out and I'd jump in the ocean and I'd feel all right again. When I see Jack's face, you now with his patch on, I think of the spirit of surfing at its best. I got to spend some time with him. I spent about two or three hours with him at his house. And you know, you asked me, you know, if, if I'd been surfing, and I said, yeah, you know, I'd be surfing around Santa Cruz. And and uh, at the time, I was like, you know, it's 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 really warm at the moment, you know. And sure enough, he just turned around and looked up to me, and he goes, "You're welcome." Well, I guess when we think of Jack O'Neill, the first thing we think of is the wetsuit. But I think that's a bit obvious. I think more than that, it's a uh, this adventurous life, this pioneer, the pirate. He was definitely a passionate man, you know, passionate about adventure, passionate about nature. Conversations with Jack were an adventure. I don't think I'll ever know anybody with that level of intellect and that level of joy in conversation and wanting to, to understand the world and do better for the world. For all of us floating out here, every single one of us, some of the best moments of our lives have been spent in the water, waiting under that great dome of sky and catching that perfect wave that has taken us to where we need to be. And for most of us, that great ride has happened in a wetsuit that Jack invented. To Jack from all of us, Thanks for the ride that we've all had, and thanks for making our lives better. And it wasn't just the paddle out in Santa Cruz, it was the paddle outs that occurred around the world. Today was a very special day. We uh, did a paddle out for Jack O'Neill to celebrate his life. It was uh, definitely a very magical moment. It was amazing. I, I can't really explain how that felt out there. It was. Um, it was special and something I won't forget for a very long time. He was a worldwide figure. He was an ocean leader. He was a business leader. And that is what happened today. People paid honor to him. They appreciated him. And they felt the love that he felt for them. If that wetsuit wasn't here, I would have done a different sport, I would have been able to kite or surf. Oh, I'd just like to say thank you, Jack. He carried it forward constantly. And as they say in our neck of the woods in Africa, may your wings never lose a feather. The thing that I admire most about, you know, Jack and his whole legacy is probably just the passion. The passion and the determination that he had just to go off on a limb and start this whole thing. That's something that I think we all can learn from. It's that love for the ocean that makes all of us want to spend as much time in the water as possible. And it's what connects Jack to all of us. To quote Jack one last time, it's been a hell of a ride and long may it continue.